Hey guys, welcome back to our channel. Before we get started, click that like button, turn on notifications, give all a huge thumbs up. Good day friends, my name is Ina Irby, and I'm a mom. Courage to Change, July 23rd. A miraculous change has come about because of my commitment to the Al-Anon program. I have discovered that I have a sense of humor. When I came to these rooms, I never cracked a smile and resented anyone who did. I couldn't understand all the laughter during meetings. I didn't hear anything funny. Life was tragic and serious. Recently, I was sharing about a series of events that I had found extremely difficult. It had been one of those weeks in which everything seemed to go wrong. The odd part was that now that it was over, I found my traumatic tale incredibly funny. And so did most of the others at the meeting. More than any other change I have observed in myself, I find this the most glorious. It tells me that I see myself and my life in a more realistic way. I am no longer a victim, full of self-pity and bent on control of every aspect of my life. Today, I can take myself and my circumstances more lightly. I can even allow joy and laughter to be a part of a difficult experience. Today's reminder, if I take a step back and look at this day as if I were watching a movie, I am sure to find at least a moment where I can enjoy some comic relief. The quote is from Ethel Barrymore, quote, you grow up the day you have the first real laugh at yourself, end quote. I'll read that again. You grow up the day you have the first real laugh at yourself. Courage to change. Affirmations for the inner child. It's on communication. I can communicate without yelling. In my chaotic family, someone was always shouting. We didn't discuss things rationally or speak quietly. Whoever could yell the loudest was the one who got heard. Whoever could shout the other down won. This is what I learned to call communication. Today, I will listen to my inner child. He does not shout to be heard or verbally bully others into submission. He expresses himself clearly and succinctly, even in anger. As I listen to him, he learns to listen to me. Together we begin to communicate. Affirmations for the inner child. I hope this helps you on your healing journey, friends. Follow your bliss and be good humans.